Nashville's Moog Fest is set to relaunch in just five days. The annual music festival was called off last year, so it could be totally revamped. News 13's Ashley Searles is streaming live outside Asheville's Moog Factory. Ashley, tickets are selling fast. They are. Moog Fest 2014 is expected to be longer, busier, and organizers say better than any others. I tune it all, you know, by hand and ear. It's not a common thing these days for a synth to be 100% analog. I actually calibrated one for uh, Kanye West, Depeche Mode, and Alicia Keys. Moog machines made only in this factory in the heart of Asheville are famous. And before it was called off last year, so was the annual Moog Music Festival. While it was an amazing music festival in the past, it wasn't such a great representation of who we are as a company. So in the heat of success, Moog planners took an 18-month breather to make it cooler. Now we feel like it better reflects who we are at Moog. This year, the factory's festival will be 48 hours longer. During the days, they've added tech and innovation panels. We have like 90 of you know, the world's brightest creative minds coming to Asheville. Organizers are expecting it to sell out, but Moog staffer Emmy Parker says the most interesting thing has been the uptick in press coverage. People are going to be here for five days in Asheville, and Asheville is a gorgeous place. Now more people will just know that. 300 tech, travel, and music media outlets are scheduled to be here, hitting events at a dozen different local spots. Money will be flowing into the city, even though many of those events they're free. We're aware that not everyone has the funds to pay for a ticket and certainly not everyone you know can spend three thousand dollars on a handmade synthesizer but everyone can learn about science technology everyone can be inspired by the work that Bob Moog did. Now Moog Fest is set to kick off on Wednesday to find out any information on scheduling or how you can get tickets you can head to our website at WLOS.com. Reporting live tonight in downtown Asheville, Ashley Searles, News 13.